Many years ago, legends told of a village so beautiful, so peaceful, and so handsome. A village overflowing with populations of the strongest warrior elephants. But then one night, something terrible happened. Robloxians swarmed the village, burning everything into the ground, leaving nothing but smoke and ashes. That is except for one small elephant, buried and protected from the flames. His face burnt, his heart broken, and though he may have lived to tell the tale, the damage had already been done. Rami! Rami, where the heck are you? Are you kidding me? He told me he would meet me here at half past, and now it is quarter to three. That's right, ladies and gentlemen. Rami Dino was supposed to be here by now, but as per usual, he's late. <laughs> Seriously, Rami Dino, where are you? Wait, he's playing basketball all by himself. Ah, oh, so sad. Rami Dino, you know we're not supposed to be playing basketball. I had something really important I wanted to ask you. Anyways, the favor that I wanted to ask you was Rami Dino, will you? Wait a minute. Do you guys hear that? It sounds like the fire alarm. Oh, don't tell me somebody's doing a prank again. Wait, what? Rami, did you just see all those people running past? Huh? I saw butterflies. Rami, what are, you, what are you talking about? There was definitely a group of people right now that just ran in this direction. What? What is going on? Are they escaping the school because of a fire? Well, ladies and gentlemen, is it something really, really bad? I, I don't know, but I need to find out. Wait, Rami, look. If you look inside of this classroom, Rami Dino, there's police. And a detective? And wait, that's Mousy, but she's got no legs. Ladies and gentlemen, it looks like right now this is a serious situation, okay? Stay back, everyone. This is police business only. I do not know what this is, but it looks like we have a detective and a policeman surrounding the scene right now. Oh, he's telling us to stay back and try to hit us with a bat then. Wait, excuse me. Excuse me, cheesy sir. Did you see what happened here? Callie, somebody broke into the school and burned. And Mousy's legs off? What? Oh my goodness, this is really bad. Hey, Rami. Psst, Rami. Did you hear that? Whoa! Oh my goodness, Rami Dino, this, ladies and gentlemen, sounds like a job for Detective Rami and Kelly to solve. That's right, this, uh, this detective just keeps smacking people with his, uh, his magnifying lens, and I don't think that's gonna solve the crime. Okay, well, I think the first thing that we need to do, Rami, is check the CCTV footage to see what really happened here. Now, Rami Dino... I'm pretty sure you know where a computer is, right? Wait, nice toes. R Rami, focus. Okay, Rami, let's go find the CCTV. Okay, Rami, shh. I'm pretty sure that this over here is the CCTV room of this entire building, which means if we could just sneak inside, we can get ourselves the CCTV footage. Okay, so Rami Dino, I think somehow we need to try and get inside of that room but it's clearly being heavily guarded by police so uh this this is gonna be impossible wait a minute what's this all i want is cheese what uh <laughs> there's a giant piece of cheese right there did you say cheese yes Jeez. Nope. How about? Okay, Rami Dino. Well, it looks like we found the perfect way for us to be able to break into the CCTV room. That's right, Rami. We just need some cheese. <laughs> Rami Dino, I want you to get so much cheese that this police dog will literally eat it all and explode. Okay, Rami, I'm gonna split up. I'm gonna go this direction and you go that direction, okay? Perfect. Let's go get ourselves some cheese. Wait, R Rami, did he really just walk into the wall? I see no cheese. Rami, you know, you're gonna have to go and look way further than that. Seriously, you're gonna blow our cover. Oh my goodness. Okay, you know what? 
I'll see you in five minutes, Rami. Try and find some cheese, okay? Uh, ladies and gentlemen, I have looked around literally this entire school. And let me tell you, I haven't found a single piece of cheese. Wait, Rami Dino, please tell me that you found some cheese. Yep. Oh my goodness, yes. Okay, we can finally do the mission. Okay, where is the cheese, Rami? Right here. Yes, Rami. Ah, uh, that's a carrot. Rami Dino, that is not a piece of cheese. Please tell me you found the piece of cheese. Oh, Rami, now we're never going to be able to get in and get the CCTV. Psst. Huh? Wait, what was that? Wait. Oh, jeez. Oh, my goodness. Hey, uh, excuse me, Flamingo, sir. Could I please have that piece of cheese? I heard you wanted some cheese. That's right, Heaven Does. I could really do with that piece of cheese right now. So I can use it to bribe the policeman. I, I mean, uh, to eat. I really like eating cheese. That's right. Cheese is my favorite meat. I literally eat tons of different cheeses every single day. Wait, what was that sound? Please! Please don't eat me! I have a kid! Don't eat me! Uh, okay. That is the weirdest piece of cheese I've ever seen. <laughs> Anyways, can I please have that piece of cheese now? Okay, listen, kid. I know you want this really special cheese. And trust me, it's going to cost a lot. Okay, I have no idea what a lot is, but I really need the cheese. C can I have it and pay you later, please? No. Not you. Him? Wait, are you talking about Rami Dino? You're just gonna hand the cheese over? What? Are you kidding me? Why? Because he is cooler than you. Okay, I see how it is. You flipping bully. Anyways, Rami, it looks like you have the cheese in your hand, which means you are responsible right now for distracting that security guard. Okay, Rami, you know what you have to do, right? Yes. Go on, Rami. Do it. Show it. Rami, stop running into walls. What is wrong with you? Oh, wait. Is he distracting him? <gasps> Here we go. He's distracting him right now. I have never seen anybody want cheese so much, ladies and gentlemen. But it looks like the distraction worked perfectly. Okay, we don't have much time. We need to hack into the mainframe right now and find out what happened on this CCTV footage. Okay, here we go. I'm breaking in at any second. <gasps> Perfect. Okay, so it doesn't look like much is going on in here. <gasps> Wait a minute. There's Mousy. <gasps> Oh my goodness, she's grabbing a book. Okay. Wait, who is, who is that? It's torture! Oh! He just burnt her legs off? And now, he's running away? Oh my goodness, I can't believe this! Ladies and gentlemen, we found our suspect. It's torture, but the only problem with that is we don't know who torture is! He's always wearing a mask and a hat and a buddy suit. But wait. I think I have the perfect idea of how I can find out which person inside of this school right now is the criminal. Okay, so ladies and gentlemen, as you can see, I have five suspects in front of me right now. That's right, we did some background checks, and you are the only five people who didn't have a strong enough alibi to prove where you were during the time the event took place. We also figured out it was an inside job because, well, there was no breaking in entering during the time b somebody pulled the fire bell as a distraction and well c you know all the doors were locked guys it's a school that is locked i don't know why but it is so it has to be one of you five ellie george mr p robbie and rami that's right wait rami Rami, what are you doing? Rami, you're supposed to be on my side. Rami, get over here, you flipping Randy. Okay, well, at least, ladies and gentlemen, that narrows it down to only four members of our convicted felons. So listen up, punks. We're gonna have a series of questions to find out which one of you it was the butt off Mousy's legs. So I might as well just ask, did any of you burn Mousy's legs off? Nope, 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 nope. Well, let me tell you something. One of you is lying. Ladies and gentlemen, if you think you know who it is, then hit the like button right now down below in this video and also comment who you think it is. Okay, so ladies and gentlemen, it is time for me to start interviewing our candidates here to see which one of them burnt off Mousy's legs. And that is exactly what I'm about to do right now. 
So, question one is incredibly simple. After observing the CCTV footage, we found out that, well, Torture Piggy has legs. So, the person that did the crime must have legs. So, uh, I'm going to go along each person right here. You most definitely have legs. You have very short legs. You have really skinny legs. And you... Oh. Um, you, you don't have any legs. Bye. <laughs> Oh, uh, I'm sorry. I, I didn't mean to hurt your feelings. Question number two. We also know that Torch Piggy is, well, incredibly tall and is at least up to my eyeline, according to the CCTV footage. So let's go through our players right now and find out if they are at least eye level with me. So, uh, ooh, that's close, but it looks like Ellie just about makes it. And Mr. P, just going off the top of your hat, you're, you're way taller than me, but, uh... Uh, George? Hey, uh, let me just quickly, uh, check out who you are. Um, yeah, okay, listen, George, it wasn't you. I'm really sorry, so you're gonna have to go. Which means, ladies and gentlemen, we only have two culprits left, and one of them is Torture Piggy. Okay, now, ladies and gentlemen, the third and final question is definitely gonna catch somebody out, okay? This is a really tricky question that only somebody with a big brain would be able to answer. And that question, ladies and gentlemen, is not actually a question and more of a statement. That's right. The person that did the crime was not a potato. Which means, I I'm really sorry, uh, Mr. P, but uh, it looks like you weren't uh, evil enough. Oh, please, can it be me? I want to be him. Uh, okay, this this is weird. Uh, okay, Mr. P, you're gonna have to, uh, you're gonna have to leave. I'm really sorry that it's not you, and, uh, that's right. Now, just another question, ladies and gentlemen. Wait. Guys, there's only, there's only one person left right now. Uh, Ellie? That's right, Ellie, but that means that you are the criminal. Why did you do it, Ellie? Why did you burn Mousy's legs off? <gasps> Whoa, look at the eyes. You have found my true identity, but don't worry, I'll be back. Wait, wait, what? What? Where did he go? He, he was right here. What? He literally just disappeared. Please tell me somebody saw that. See? This guy saw it. Anyways, it looks like we discovered who the criminal was. So I guess we should go tell the detective. So guys, let's go find the detective and tell him right now that we discovered the criminal. Detective! Detective, you gotta listen to me right now. I think I know who the murderer is. Detective, listen! I know who the murderer is! Wait a minute. It's torture! What? Are you kidding me? He bought them to a crisp. Your next friend! But yes, guys, that is going to be it from me today. If you guys did enjoy this video, then please do hit the subscribe button. What are you waiting for? As you guys can see, there is two videos on the screen right now. This one is the true identity of your favorite piggy character, and this one is a flipping ratty. <laughs> That's right, guys. Again, thank you so much for watching, and I guess I'll see you all in the next video. Goodbye!